YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I feel like this year I have crafted and made more things than I ever have in my life because maybe it's because I have kids. I think that's it. But again, it is spirit week for the boys at their school and next to not next week. Next week is Christmas. They won't be in school. But tomorrow at Thomas's school, it is Dress Like a Candy Cane Day. Now, I don't know about other parents out there, but I don't have really white clothes for my kids because that's just not very practical to me. Like, it just, that just doesn't make sense. So, the only thing that I do have is a tablecloth that has candy canes on it. So, I got to thinking that maybe if I cut just fray and break out my hot glue gun, I can make Thomas maybe a vest that he can wear tomorrow for candy cane day. So, that is what we're going to do today. And if it comes out right, I may try to make one for Theo. That way, maybe they'll at least let me take their picture in them if they both wear them together. So we'll see. But that's what we're going to do. Vest out of a tablecloth. Let's go. Okay, so this is the tablecloth. I just have it folded in half. And it's one of those, like it's not plastic. Like, well, it is plastic, but it's not like the dollar store plastic suitcases. Suitcases. <laughs> tablecloths. I don't know why I have suitcases on the brain. But it's one of the... Ones that are like thicker and lined on the inside with like that white furry material. So that is what I'm using. I have a sweater vest. Um, one of Thompson's sweater vests. And I'm just going to use these. We'll use this as a template to cut around so that I have some sort of a guide instead of just trying to freehand the vest. And a marker, but I don't think I'm going to use it. I'm just going to lay this here and just cut around it. My handy dandy hot glue gun. Right here, like, hot glue solves all problems. And some glue sticks. So let's go. Alright, so here is the outline that I cut out. Um, I tried to leave one inch of seam allowance all the way around so that way when I tuck the sides under to like create a hem, it won't be too tight for him even though he's skinny mini. But still, I don't want it to be tight. So. One inch seam allowance all the way around, and now we start to glue. And we're gonna have to cut this one, the top sheet at the neckline here, so that it opens. And that, I'm definitely gonna use the marker for it and draw it first before I cut. 
And the plan, once I finish cutting, is to use uh, actual peppermint like this. And I'm pointing to the candy cane. Peppermint like this as the button on the front of the vest. That's what I'm planning to do. Wash your fingers that it works. So now I'm going to pull these apart. These are our back. This is our front. We're going to sit our front to the side. Since I'm about to start, I realized that I don't even have the hot glue gun turned on. So it is ice cold. Yeah, ice cold. Alright, so here is the front of the vest, and I just took my. What did I do with it? I just took a ruler and measured half a centimeter from the neck that I had cut out to start where I'm going to cut for the neck and then a line down the center. I know it's off center, but my thinking is since I want to put like faux buttons in it with the actual um, peppermint. I figured it would like pull one side over to the other so I would allow myself more space for it to be pulled over to the other side when you put the button through the slit I don't know if that makes sense <laughs> but like you guys know how when you button something it like pulls the two sides together so I just kind of wanted to still give him some space face and some room so he's not like super tight I'm hoping that works I've never like made clothes before really to this extent so I don't know don't quote me on any of this I'm not a seamstress by any means I'm just a sort of kind of crafter who's really cheap and trying to make things for her kids instead of buying it <laughs> Back up some. All right, so it fits sort of, kind of, but I didn't cut it on the black line, and now I kind of regret it because I cut it straight down the middle, and can you stop? And lo and behold, it won't close, so no buttons there. But... I guess it's okay. Well, it's gonna have to be okay. 